Welcome to a new week of The Rundown. On this episode, the Navy introduces its new branding campaign. The deadline to complete BRS mandatory training is fast approaching, and the 2018 Navy Week schedule has been released. The Power to Go Beyond is a new branding campaign the Navy introduced during this year's Army-Navy football game. The brand sets the central theme for the Navy's new tagline, Forged by the Sea. The brand was featured nationally in a televised commercial during the second quarter of the game. A message from Commander, Navy Recruiting Command, says, Forged by the Sea describes the Navy as a team that has been forged, tempered, and toughened over 242 years of maritime dominance. More importantly, it acknowledges the Navy's unique and fundamental relationship with the sea. You can read the message, including the process behind the brand's development, on Navy Live, or by clicking the link on Navy.mil. All sailors eligible to opt into the blended retirement system must complete the blended retirement system opt-in course by December 31st, and commands must ensure that training is documented in the Fleet Training Management and Planning System, or Fleet TIMS. BRS opt-in training provides valuable information to eligible sailors who will make the decision on whether to opt into the new military retirement system next year. Remember, the decision is irreversible, so be sure to complete the training to ensure you make the best decision for yourself, your family, and your career. The training can be found on Navy eLearning, which can be accessed through My Navy portal at my.navy.mil, and on Joint Knowledge Online. More information on BRS can be found on NPC under Support and Services. Click 21st Century Sailor, Total Sailor Fitness, and then click on Personal Financial Management. The Navy Week iReach program has released a schedule of cities it plans to visit in 2018. The Navy is scheduled to visit 15 cities across the country, educating Americans in locations without a significant Navy presence about opportunities in the Navy and showing the Navy's role in national security and prosperity. The first stop will be in February in San Antonio, Texas, and the visits will end in November in Shreveport, Louisiana. Read the full list of cities the Navy plans to visit in the story on Navy.mil. The Navy has released four new updates to My Navy Portal. The updates include a bandwidth option on the new login page, an appointment scheduler, a redesigned GMT page for easier viewing, and a section to better help sailors manage their careers. Read more on the updates in the story and visit My Navy Portal at my.navy.mil. That's all for this week. For any questions, send us a message at usnpeople.fct at navy.mil. For the Chief Naval Personnel, I'm MC2 LJ Burleson. Thanks for watching.